people can't because they are supporting you and you are the governor they can do anyhow what are you turning the state into and what kind of leadership example are you setting it's wrong i mean if you don't know i'm saying it now it's wrong so um i'm just saying that uh, you should do better mr governor hi everyone uh sam here just thought i would share my thought on a few things as regards uh, the development in nigeria and specifically lagos um and if you have been following some of my recent uh, videos you would see that um, I've added my voice where needed um, with some of the things that we are hearing happening in Lagos um, very how do you put it um, very concerning very concerning stops you know which are not true reflections and representation of uh, Lagos as it as it were my call this time is to Babajide Sonwolu the executive governor of Lagos as the chief security officer of the state you have a responsibility to um, ensure that people feel safe it's part of your constitutional responsibility and in and out of electoral season you have that responsibility and we've <clears throat> we've been hearing some inciting statements from people that we know are campaigning for you and the sad part of it is that you have not condemned their violence inciting statement or address or whatever you call it or speech you know whichever one and what that means is that you're not performing your constitutional responsibility which again like I said as the chief security officer of the state Lagos State whenever there is an inciting violence inciting statement you should either call on the state uh, um, police command to get a person arrested it's your responsibility you have to lead by example people can make threats and even go to the extent of um, carrying out those threats and you do nothing it means that it means that you are complicit that's what it means but you know people rule and live by impunity people rule and live by impunity you know people do anyhow say anyhow and all of that and like I said if you are not um taking actions decisive actions against those that are uh, making insightful statements and uh, threats you know and all of that if you're not taking this decisive actions it means that you are complicit and you are not carrying out your again constitutional responsibility so um and 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 you know again these people that we have seen are in your camp they are campaigning for you 
and they make this insightful statement in support of your um, candidacy and re-election let people decide free and fair and in a transparent manner with zero threats in Lagos State who they want as their governor <laughs> let people make that choice freely people um, have that liberty to choose without any threats who they want as their governor governor Sonwolu, you have the constitutional responsibility to ensure that the people of Lagos State are safe and it's part of your job it's part of your job you are not the governor of APC you are a governor from APC from the moment you took an out of office you became the governor of the entire residents and uh, citizens of, of Lagos people that are supporting you as we have seen in different videos and uh, uh, across social media platforms making inciting um, comment you can't choose and pick who you are going to arrest who you are not going to everybody is equal under law except otherwise you want to say um, again this is not a partisan statement it's not an attack on your person this is me calling your attention to your constitutional responsibility to say that you have the responsibility to um, uh, ensure the safety of Lagosians and if there is anyone which there is as we have seen that is um, threatening the lives of others because they want to support you or they are supporting you you should get them arrested you should get them you should get them stopped people can't because they are supporting you and you are the governor they can do anyhow what are you turning the state into and what kind of leadership example are you setting it's wrong i mean if you don't know i'm saying it now it's wrong so um i'm just saying that uh, you should do better mr governor thank you